Britney Spears. That's women eat, 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 eat. If it looks like a fucking broomstick can beat you up, fucking eat. I was at the Arc Light at the movie theater day. I saw a girl like walking out of 24 hour fitness. Right? Like that's like a, you know like anorexic chicks that like also work out. I don't, they're drinking Red Bull or shooting it between their toes to get energy or some shit. <laughs> And I, don't, don't get sad, dude, because there's going to be a mean part in a second that's going to lift us all up like the wing beneath fucking Barbara Hershey's cancer-ridden wings. I'll make sad movie callbacks. I don't give a shit. Um, no, but I always get fucked up because my girlfriend came home and was all brainwashed. My girlfriend, um, she reads Us Weekly and calls it The Paper. Anybody else? <laughs> Anybody else? She thinks Noam Chomsky is a character from Star Wars. <laughs> That's actually not true, because the night I first did that joke, I came home and I told her that joke, and she said, no, uh that's just somebody you made up. <laughs> yeah, fuck, man, she's fucking really nice and pretty, and she smells good, so what are you gonna do? <laughs> Such bullshit. But she came home like, oh, Britney Spears, is because the VMAs, Britney Spears takes like eight Vicodin and some NyQuil and shit, and goes out there and flaps around for four minutes, and 50 Cent is so offended when all his jokes are about getting shot and raping people, but yeah, 50 Cent. Getting her high horse with Kanye West and those fucking vented fucking styles from Teen Wolf sunglasses and be on one more magazine cover because then I'm going to buy a shotgun and kill you and Bill O'Reilly in the same day. Yeah. For justice and ironic purposes yeah. combined. Yeah. Because you're both dicks. Yeah, so that's the worst. Like, Britney Spears wasn't fat. Britney Spears is thinner than 95% of every person in this country. And I know we live in beautiful Hollywood and West LA and all that shit. Okay, she's a nine at every other mall except the West Side Pavilion or the Beverly Center, okay? She's a six here. <laughs> she's some tubby chick like you wouldn't talk. But in fact, like Idaho, she is a hot piece of ass. She's 25 and has two kids, all right? Go to any bowling alley right now on a Saturday night anywhere in the middle of the country <laughs> and find a 25-year-old with two kids. Holy shit. It. it will look like a spare tire factory wrapped in mayonnaise and bacon, I'm pretty sure. Oh, oh she was too fat to be wearing that on TV, you know, or too fat to be wearing that. And it's like, a week before, my girlfriend, who's about the same size as Britney Spears, because she's normal size, went to the beach with me and she's in a bikini. So if Britney Spears is too fat, am I supposed to throw a tarp over her and call Greenpeace and say, get your own ride home, bitch, and take off? No! <laughs> Holding hands, watching the sunset till we die. <laughs> That's how I roll. Fuck, man, that is the worst. Those stupid Britney Spears being crazy with her shit. Uh, oh, no, it's a, yeah, the vagina. That's the worst. Because like, if you get photographed once, shame on you. You get photographed 19 times and your fucking sh shame cave is exposed. <laughs> Just, her, her vagina at this point is like kind of like the Bible. We're like, everyone's seen it. People that wanted to, people that didn't want to. At this point, it's just like, she needs to close it up and put it away in a drawer somewhere at a Super 8 motel. And maybe one night a trucker in a fit of loneliness and weakness will crack it open for a spell. And that's about it. All right, guys, that is my time. I'm Dan Bollock. It will look like a spare tire factory wrapped in mayonnaise and bacon, I'm pretty sure. <laughs>